What's happening? Well, there's so much happening throughout our area this weekend. You might not get to all of them, but maybe you'll get to a few. So we want to give you a great list. Well, starting off our list of what's happening in our area this weekend. Today, this afternoon, take your lunch outside to the Morris Performing Arts Center for their Fridays by the Fountain. You can enjoy a free concert from Southside Denny and grab a bite from some of their vendors that they'll have on site. Fridays on the Fountain will continue through the end of August. What a great way to spend a beautiful day outdoors. And you can also come on out to the St. Joe County 4-H Fair. Rides, games, live performances, amazing fair food, and so much more await you and the entire family at the fairgrounds. Children eight and under have free entry into the fair, and tonight you can catch a performance by Chapel Heart at the grandstands, and tomorrow morning you can catch the antique tractor pole mm -hmm. and finish off the evening with some karaoke. Busy day. And that free entry, once again, for those children under eight. Sounds like a great time. Take them out to the fair. It's definitely fair season, but also bring your lawn chairs or your picnic blanket and join everyone at the Riverbend Park for a family friendly summer concert. Local band Jake Miller and the Midwest Heat will play a few tunes for the kids and family, followed by their signature sad country music. So you can bring all of your picnic, you can bring your dinner, but you can also get some food from the food truck and they will play. Um, you can have the kids play on the playground. This event is hosted by the Middlebury Public Library. So head over to the Middlebury area and enjoy that really great free outdoor concert. And if you want some more live music, you have that. lots of options. You can head over to the Reese Theater in Plymouth where musician Tim Stop is returning to Plymouth for a performance on Saturday, July 8th at 7.30 coming up very soon. Tim first played at the Young Amphitheater during Reese on the Road series in the summer of 2021. He is a Midwest singer songwriter who has recently played on several major international tours, opening for classic bands like Chicago, Ario Speedwagon, and others. Lots of music happening, but as we mentioned, it is fair season. So come one, come all to the LaGrange County 4 H Fair. You can check out all of the attractions, including the Kid Zone, with free activities and other games. There's other excitement, and it includes the Butterfly Garden. I'm not sure what this is, but the Hollywood Racing Pigs, I'm sure you're not going to want to miss that, the Demolition Derby, and the Big Top Circus and Thrill Show, and it's going to be happening under the Big Top Tent, so head on out to LaGrange. We'll have to see those pigs. I don't know what that is either. Right. <laughs> and of course, it is the first Friday of the month, meaning that many towns will be holding their monthly First Friday community celebrations. We feature both Goshen and South Bend's events right here on Hometown Living. Goshen is hosting their annual car cruising or their annual cruising car show featuring classic cars and motorcycles and South Bend is celebrating the simple joys of summer with the backyard barbecue. Let us know if your town hosts any first Friday events. We would love to know. We'd love to feature them right here on Hometown Living and there's a few sweet celebrations this weekend as it holds World Chocolate Day, mm. National Freezer Pop Day and National Sugar Cookie Day. Of course, you can head over to our Facebook page. Let us know where you'll be enjoying some of those sweet treats, but also what events that you would like to feature right here on Hometown Living for our next What's Happening, and we hope you have a really great weekend.